everything was going okay until I felt the bit start to wander. So I don't think that's <clears throat> too terrible. But I'm very happy that I caught it when I did. Mm. Yeah. A recap of the night's adventures. I had originally planned to do a fixed shelf. Actually, I, I planned to do two fixed shelves in the upper. It is now my belief that that would represent one and two. That would be tiny shelves. So then I thought maybe I'll put one in the middle. And then I thought most people when they're putting in kitchen uppers do shelf pins. I don't currently have a shelf pin jig and that's not something that I would want to whip up myself. That's the kind of jig I would rather purchase. So when I get upstairs, I'll order one off Amazon. There's nothing available locally. Then I went to route out the channels for the backer board and discovered that I didn't have an appropriately sized bit. So I jumped up and went out and got something from Home Depot. This is a spiral upcut bit, which results in an unbelievably smooth, like a just a beautiful finish on the... I don't think anybody but me really cares. I'm using this um, El Cheapo router from China and the fence, uh, sorry, at one point uh, vibrated out. So there is, there's a small fault. I'm going to keep going. It's probably something I can live with. And in my recent measure 17 times cut once philosophy, I measured up exactly the depth of these were, came up with a calculation, cut it, measured it, and it's still an eighth of an inch too wide with everything added together. I've run out of things to say and, and I'm trying not to ramble on camera. So, good night.